Hey guys, today we're gonna to be going over the Mountain Lock High-Low Hitch for four inch RV bumpers. So the Mountain Lock High-Low Hitch is gonna be an excellent option for any trailer or RV with a four inch by four inch standard bumper. This is an industry standard size, so it would be good to go ahead and measure, but chances are, if you have this square bumper on the back of your RV, it's gonna be this four inch by four inch. Basically, what this does is, it's gonna give us a connection point for a two inch hitch mounted accessory such as a bike rack that you see here or a cargo carrier. So if you're familiar with RVs, you've probably heard of the hitch mounted bumpers before. It's probably not a new theory to you guys, but the Mountain Lock high-low hitch is definitely gonna be an excellent option for a few reasons. Number one, on the top here, we actually have a built-in tension bolt. And essentially what this does is when we tighten this down, it's gonna help pin the shank of our hitch mounted accessory inside the trailer hitch here. Therefore, it's gonna cut down on that excess movement and rattle, making for a much more stronger and secure connection point. So another nice thing about the high-low hitch is that it doesn't use any U-bolts like some of the other bumper-mounted hitches do use. Now, the advantage of that is, number one, we're gonna have a much more even spread of pressure here across the entire plate. So we're not gonna risk deforming or damaging our bumper. It's also gonna ensure that it stays tight Sometimes U-bolts can work themselves loose over time and again causing damage or possibly losing our accessory. We're not going to have any issues with the high-low hitch. As you can see here, the bracket design is quite intricate. Everything sort of sits in one way, locks into place, and it really has a nice firm grip hold on our bumper here. So all of our components are going to be made of steel and they're also going to be coated with a nice black powder coat. So this only looks nice, it actually blends in pretty well with most of the bumpers are painted black but it's gonna help it hold up in due time, making it more durable, hiding any nicks or scratches, and help preventing it from rust and corrosion. It's also gonna be made right here in the USA, so you know you're getting a well-made quality product. So with our hitch here, we're gonna be getting a 300 pound weight capacity, and this is a lot. However, you actually are gonna be limited to what the RV manufacturer allows for the bumper. So chances are it's not gonna be this high, but we actually do sell some brackets separately that allow you to beef up your bumper if you really need to obtain the higher weight capacity here of this hitch. Now, it can actually be installed one of two ways. Right now, we have it sort of in the rise position so that the receiver tube is on top of the bumper. There's also another position where we can install it so the receiver tube is on the bottom of the bumper. Now, depending on which location you want to install this in, it is sort of preference, but also in regards to what we're going to be using it for we'd probably wanna go ahead and install it in the rise position. That way we gain some clearance for our accessories such as our bike rack or cargo carrier. Now along with this, our receiver tube opening here, it's gonna be an industry standard as well. It's gonna accept two inch hitch mounted accessories. It does look a little overwhelming at first, but everything really goes only in one way. It's actually pretty easy to install. But essentially this bracket design, the tension bolt, all this allows it to do is it evenly distributes the weight of the accessory across the entire surface of the plates on the bumper. So we don't have to risk deforming our bumper or the bolts coming loose and losing our accessory. So last but not least, our high-low hitch, it's gonna come with a lifetime warranty and it's made right here in the USA. So we just removed the high-low hitch and as you can see, this is what our bumper looks like. We don't have any scratches to the paint and there's no deformations here to the bumper tube. So it's just like factory. So in regards to installation, I know what you're gonna think. As soon as you get this out of the box, you're gonna see that there's quite a few different brackets and they all sort of have these weird jagged cuts on them. It's honestly a little overwhelming at first. I thought this was gonna be a little bit more difficult to install initially as well. However, everything fits into place really one way and it's actually super easy. You really only need a couple of sockets to install everything. So I would definitely encourage you guys to try this one at home by yourself. That'll do it for our look at the Mountain Lock high-low hitch for four-inch RV bumpers.